International Service for Human Rights. Tiene la palabra. This is a joint statement. Deaths of Africans and people of African descent at the hands of law enforcement continue to occur in many countries with little to no accountability. For example, a full conclusion to all seven emblematic cases has not yet been reached. And families continue to seek truth, justice, and guarantees of non-repetition as well as prosecution and punishment of all those responsible. We assert that states are continuing to deny the existence and the impact of systemic racism, especially institutional racism. Our view is that states actively protect the interests of police institutions in order to maintain the status quo, which is designed to oppress Africans and people of African descent. Regarding the, uh, regarding the Elmer report, we recognize that um, the abuse of policing will not be cured simply by more comprehensive data collection. However, we understand the importance of racist aggregated data when it comes to understanding and monitoring the outcomes of interactions between law enforcement and communities. In this regard, we strongly believe that lack of data collection by several states is due to the fact that they benefit from the subjugation of Africans and Afro-descendants and that they do not want their practices to come to light should their exact numbers be revealed. We call on all states to take immediate and robust action to address both the culture of impunity and the laws and policies that are allow law enforcement to use excessive force against communities of Africans and Afro-descendants and also to address the root causes of this violence and lack of accountability. Thank you.